全球媒体领袖的重点年度峰会——世界新闻媒体年会，首度在台湾举办。来自五十七个国家、超过五百家的媒体、近千位的媒体人在台北齐聚一堂。I believe Taiwan must be allowed to cement its status as a ray of light in an increasing circle of darkness, authoritarianism, and control. In recent years, there have been authoritarian forces targeting this freedom we have worked so hard to achieve. There are constant attempts to extend influence on the Taiwan media environment. They are also well-funded, large-scale disinformation campaigns. 中华民国总统蔡英文亲自出席年会，致辞表示，去年《经济学人》资讯社报告，台湾被评为全面民主，居亚洲之冠。今年无国界记者组织发布的全球新闻自由指数，台湾进步三名，在一百八十个国家之中排名第三十五。也谈到了假讯息已经成为民主国家最困难的挑战之一。The rise of AI has benefited us all. But it also allowed this information to be generated and distributed at an unprecedented rate. Our best response to propaganda and misinformation is more journalism, ensuring the highest standards of rigor and independence are upheld. In this regard, we must recognize the immense possibilities and at the same time huge challenges and understandable fears of artificial intelligence. 而为期三天的年会将聚焦在 AI 科技创新、编辑式转型以及地缘政治挑战等国际重要议题。以上是新唐人亚太电视高建伦、曾新敏台湾台北报道。